Hi. <clears throat> this here is the 311 unorganized zoological militia. And it's what I have here is a, 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 another uh, detection device that is uh, off the uh, shelf. And it's a laser temperature gun. Uh, one thing that I've noticed about these uh, so called reptilians, which only make up about 1% of uh, some uh, Bible lizard that can uh, flip a boulder a uh, half a mile, that there is one of the lizards that uh, does imitate a human being and it can uh, transform its shape into it. The uh, rest of the uh, uh, reptilians are not there. <clears throat> But however, uh, frogs are, and there's a lot of amphibians, salamanders, and toads that do uh, transform into uh, a human image. And um, besides that one, there's a symbiosis with them. Uh, a symbiosis is that they, they both help each other and they're allied on after us. But however, the uh, amphibians are more uh, suppressive, and they will con uh, conquer a, a, a huge black bottle spider to uh, make a shell and to be, to be, to be use that. They'll, they'll make a, uh, a dummy suit uh, to uh, get around in. But uh, the best way is to, uh, to be on a hot day around about 100 degrees this here will build up confidence because a human's uh, temperature is 96 or 98 degrees is close to uh, 100 de degrees and uh, you you know well you, you can still use it around uh, room temperature or outside but you're you're not going to have the confidence because i i could use the laser gun on myself when it's uh, uh say you know 38 degrees and see that my my palm is uh, turned down to 66 degrees because I have cold air on my skin. So uh, once you get to around 100 degrees, you, you'll have confidence when you see someone dives to uh, <coughs> 63 degrees. And Mormons, and they average 63 degrees on their body temperatures. And they cannot even melt a, a, a piece of Hershey Hershey chocolate in their mouth. And that's on a hot day of, of uh, 100 degrees. I've, I've handed them chocolate and uh, hoping that it wouldn't melt before it got in their hand and have them gag on it that they could not uh, dissolve the, the, uh, the, the, uh, uh, the candy because of their, their low uh, body temperature. And uh, on that, a Mormon gets their name from a salamander. They croak more men, more men, and they uh, went to uh, Utah on the hopes of crickets. Uh, promise in the uh, the the promise was crickets, and that's how they all moved by the massive thousands out there. Some uh, entomologists had some uh, some wit of that, and and that there is why the uh, the Mormons, the the eldest zoo prudes, went to. Uh, 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 Utah is because of the promise of crickets and I've uh, ruled others before on giving them not money uh, but a sack of crickets and uh, I killed over oh well I well I, I leaded JFK to Dallas on that with uh, uh, a hope of beating these green wing uh, bugs and uh, and and he knew that we were laying up to him to shoot him at, but his stomach got the best of him but uh, they're uh, uh, let's see if I can get it back in here and find a uh, different one to take you to. See cameras. Oh, uh, where where did we go wrong? Let's see. Let's see. Where are we? Okay, I just lost. God damn it. Uh, let, let me go through this here. Okay, here we go. Okay, now I got it. Now we got it. Uh, now we're my favorites. Okay. This right here is what we're looking at. We're looking at a spider most often, or there could be some other black uh, poisonous worm that is the uh, size and shape 
of uh, Utah, and it can stretch out over 30 feet and still uh, keep on talking. But it's what they're doing. They're putting on a, a dummy suit. Right, right here is Zubama, and uh, you know, I, everyone says fuck Zubama, but here he is making himself available. Uh, so they're, they're making a shill, and they crawl in it. Like, I'm, I'm more used to was uh, seeing spiders, uh, water striders, uh, worms, and other maggots more than I'm seeing you know, lizards. I, I see a lot more of those and frogs, you know, the frogs. Uh, the, the frogs do have blood, the rest of them don't, you know, oh, Zubama, I shot him five times in the head, and he just got up and got woozy and walked out of my Hoke, uh, apartment, uh, complex that, uh, I was being, uh, destroyed by. So, um, you want to, you know, you, you can use it around room temperatures, but you, you, you know, you won't have the confidence on that unless, unless you see a dramatic drop on that. And you can have some, uh, uh, experience on, uh, on, on taking other, uh, on taking their, their temperatures, you know, I mean, they always do like to come up in groups, you know, by putting on these dummy suits and they crawl inside of it and they, they, they group, you know, I mean, Hey, uh, I, I, and they're always calling themselves friends. Uh, I think friends are myths because I've never had a friend. I, I'd never trust any of them. Uh, but then they are clones, and they come out of caves, and they and they're a close work organization, very clandestine. These here could be Mormons for all I know. Uh, <clears throat> but uh, let's see, what else was I was uh, going to say? Oh yes, you can, <clears throat> you can during the winter, you can during the winter uh, notice uh, people's breath. Uh, if if someone's uh, talking. If someone is talking to the other person, you see a, a lot of uh, steam coming out, and you know, so uh, that person would be human. But you watch the other person, and there's very little, if any, when, when they start to speak. That there is a zoo spec. But um, a after the temperatures, if you go into a frostbite thing where the temperatures are, excuse me for uh, uh, the cold, but if you if you go into uh, a long time uh, uh, coldness spill, they, they like to retreat. I used to have one who was harass me, he was a clone, and once the temperatures got way down low, he, the, the guy backed off. He would retreat and go in his hole and would, would not come out until uh, March. And and then I had to see the uh, uh, son of a bitch again. I shoot him with a, a carp arrow or something like that and tie him up against a tree. But, uh, uh, so, so anyhow, a laser temperature gun will work. You can detect them, but try to hide it because they're, they're putting on these, uh, these, these, uh, these uh, uh, dummy suits to keep you dumb, and, and they don't want you to uh, know about that. So you can probably put your laser temperature gun in a, a can of a monster energy drink and go out looking for monster energy or uh, you can put it in a sack or some other way to where they won't be able to uh, spot you readily and you could put on a uh, a bracket on your uh, your either your container your gun or on your wrist to where you can film that so we can all see it on uh, youtube a uh, uh, the temperature uh, drops on that uh, without looking at their eyeballs. Uh, so, uh, you know, because they're not always pulling those eyeballs until they they go to turn their head or they have to move inside and they have a like a, a bio uh, tissue tautness uh, string on their eyeballs and, and then they will turn it, you know, when, when they're, they most often, you know, pull their, uh, their eye shitties when they're uh, moving their head left to right. Uh, but otherwise, uh, there's there's something going on inside wearing these uh, dummy suits. Well, I, I hope I had it helps you out with a new uh, a, uh, aspect or uh, a, a, a new way to uh, detect them. A lot of people will feel sorry for them uh, and try to rescue them. But but once again, the temperatures uh, about 100 degrees and their body temperatures dropping down to 63 degrees or 48 degrees. It's a time to just, you know, lay into them with a sword. Well, you won't. There, there's very few swords I found in, here in, in this country that are militant. So you could use a machete blade to cut them apart.
And the reason why I say that uh, before again, because uh, the insect's uh, tissue does not uh, hold up to the uh, lid. I mean, the lid was designed for human and animal. It's not designed for these things here. And the tissue, will, it will pass right through their tissue. But if you were to uh, use a, uh, a machete blade and just chop them apart because uh, <clears throat> if a spider comes out of there, it's going to be big, man. It's going to be real big, 25 feet. But And they're going to be fast, too, and they're going to be zootastic, real zootastic at their uh, warfare, man. It's, it's an alien design machine, and it sucks uh, chemtrail air, and they got to have that. And it, and it gets real stuffy inside of these, uh, these uh, uh, flirt bags. So uh, watch out for people trying to rescue them, thinking that they are human, <clears throat> because they'll probably kill you. You could uh, wrap uh, a uh, <clears throat> a slinky around them <clears throat> and pull real tight and dice them up, because uh, that spider tries to get out, and it has a, about a twelve foot uh, about a twelve foot leg, uh, Avril Lavigne. Uh, I got I talked her out of hers, and a, a big long uh, leg came out of her back and it came over top of her shoulder and it had a dagger vein on it and was dripping wet you know I, I, well I wrote a song about that uh, you know I want you to stay because it was so lunatic you know but uh, you got to be careful watch yourself because they, they have zootastic abilities well I better get back uh, home but I hope you uh, have learned something from me because I have uh, a lot of experience I, uh, I came from Zootal, not that I wanted to, but because I was abducted by Ildius Zoo Prudes. And so I've seen a lot of garbage, you know, uh, coming out of them. A lot of, uh, z z you know, Zootastic uh, junk. Well, have a nice day. Thank you.